So I'm going to show you a really nice smooth straight look um, using three of the different attachments um, out of the complete set. I'm going to start by using the smoothing brush just to get my hair smooth and, and dry. And I'm just going to brush it, keep brushing it through my hair. And what that will do is that will dry it at the same time as smoothing it out, getting rid of any of the kinks and bumps and giving me some nice volume. Just keep brushing it in different directions away from the direction of the roots and that will create the volume that you need. But just keep brushing it through until it's dry. So my hair is now dry and as you can see it's given me this really nice smooth finish with a really nice shine. So it's really, really straight. So what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to use the round brush because I want to create a little bit of volume because it's very flat around my face. So just to create some volume here, I'm just going to take the front section, if I tuck that bit behind my ear, and then with the round brush, I'm going to again use it on the top heat setting, but I'm only going to use the second speed setting because my hair's actually already dry. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in at the roots, I'm going to brush the hair forward to get the ends in, and then I'm just going to roll the brush back on itself to get that really nice root lift. Warm the hair up. So I'm just going to push the cool shot button and unravel it. And then that gives me a really nice bit of root lift here to take it away from my face, which is a little bit more flattering. I'm going to use the 40mm barrel because I don't want to curl, I just want a really nice soft bend on the ends of my hair. And then I'm going to section, just rough sections. Again, I'm going to turn it on full speed setting, full temperature setting. And I'm just going to literally just bring it to the ends of my hair and curl the ends of my hair under. Once it's warm, I'm going to cool it down with a full shot button. And then you turn it off. And then you can see that it just gives you that really nice soft bend on the ends of your hair. I'm going to repeat that all the way around my hair. change the barrel for this side of my hair because I'm blowing the hair under so I don't actually need to change the, the barrel. Um, as long as the arrow is pointing down then the hair is going to wrap in the right direction. So you need to make sure that the arrow is pointing down. But I'm just going to finish off this side and then you'll see how I've created a really nice soft bend. See that it's given it that really nice soft bend and a little bit of movement. And then I'm just going to brush it through with my paddle brush. So you can see by using all three attachments, I've got a really nice smooth finish with some really nice shine. I've got the nice root lift here by using the round brush. And then at the very end, I've just got that nice kink underwards just to, just to finish the hair off and give it that little bit of movement around the bottom.